Hello everybody, welcome to Ready Steady Eat and this is your Gourmet Guru Saloni. Today I'm going to show you how to make a very simple dish, Shepherd's Pie. Shepherd's Pie is a classic British dish. My recipe is so simple and easy that if you follow it, you won't go wrong. But just ensure that you use the best quality mints and fresh herbs and vegetables. So without a delay, let me tell you what you'll need. Here's what you'll need to prepare this delicious Shepherd's Pie. For the meat filling, you will need 2 tablespoons of canola oil, 1 red onion finely diced, 2 carrots finely diced, 2 sticks of celery diced, 2 cloves of garlic minced, 500 grams of good quality minced lamb, salt and freshly ground pepper, 2 tablespoons of all purpose flour, 400 grams of chopped tomatoes or you can use tomato paste, 250 ml of chicken stock, 2 teaspoons of Worcestershire sauce, 1 tablespoon of finely chopped rosemary leaves plus a few springs for garnish. For the potato mash you will need 900 grams of potatoes, 100 ml of semi skimmed milk or half and half which is a light cream, a large knob of butter, 4 tablespoons of shredded parmesan cheese, salt to taste, 1 4 teaspoon of freshly ground black pepper and some peas and broccoli to serve with. In a saucepan, add the oil and to this oil we are going to add the onions and the carrots. We are going to allow them to cook till they turn colour for about 3 to 5 minutes. Now you can see it's changed colour so I am adding the garlic and also I am going to add the celery at this point. To this add the mince and we are going to cook it till it changes colour. I'm going to add the pepper and the salt to taste. Now you can see that it's changed colour. So I'm going to add the flour to this and let it cook for a little bit more. To this I'm going to add the rosemary, the stock. I'm using chicken stock here because I feel that the beef stock overpowers all the flavours. And to this I'm going to add the tomatoes. Let it come to a boil and then I'm going to cover it with a lid and let it cook for about one hour on low heat. And now goes in the sauce. This has been cooking now for about an hour and 15 minutes. So let's check if it's ready. Yeah, this seems to be done. Now we're going to put this into a casserole. Just dry out a little liquid if it is there before you put it into the casserole and spread it out evenly. So I have peeled and cut potatoes and I have put them to boil. Now we need to check if these are done. Yeah. So I've just pierced this and I've said they're nicely done. And now I'm going to drain them. So put the drained potatoes into a bowl. To this I'm going to add this butter and I'm going to mash the potatoes. To this I'm going to add the half and half along with the cheese. I'm going to add some pepper and some salt. Give it a nice stir and make it into a nice smooth paste. Now I'm going to preheat the oven at 190 degrees Celsius. Now I'm going to top the lamb mixture with the mashed potatoes and using a spatula I'm going to smooth it out. Now take a fork and make a pattern like this. I am doing a basket weave here. But you can do any kind of a pattern that you want. And I am going to poke the remaining rosemary into the potato mash. Now put this into the oven and let it bake for about 25 minutes or until the potatoes are golden brown. Wow! Look at this. Fresh out of the oven. Hot and delicious shepherd's pie my ultimate comfort food. Serve it with fresh vegetables, broccoli and peas. Do try this recipe out and let me know how it turned out in the comment section below. But before that, don't forget to hit the like button. Subscribe to our channel for many more easy and delicious recipes. This is me Saloni signing off. Bye!